Hey there! Welcome to another edition of Redneck Tech. I'm home, your host, and today, woo! God dang, Jethro, we got some awesome stories for you. Now, first off, I don't know if you guys have heard or not, but Facebook has released a brand new app. That's right. This thing's geared for the consumer, and it can basically change your face, not your face, but your Facebook, on your Android-based phone. And so, you can carry that around, and instead of to click around it, it has your face on the Facebook phone. And also, HTC, they claim they're original, and they're going to have their own phone that comes out about this called the HTC first. Yeah. That's right. So we have a full article written on this. So if you guys want to check out and learn more information about this, you guys will see that all in the information below. Now, for gamers out there, man, I'm telling you right now, y'all is in some sad shape because LucasArts, no more lightsabers, no more wands, maybe no more Yoda. Ooh. Because God dang it, boy, LucasArts has been shut down today. Even though Disney just five months ago paid them millions of dollars to integrate it, they said it's cheaper to license them out like hookers than to actually do any in-game development with Star Wars. Now, y'all know that there was two games coming out, Star Wars 1313. You know, there's a game where you were going to be kind of a bad guy, a bounty hunter over on the planet. You know, hunting around on level 13, 13 of the underground, you know, looking for some stuff to kill. And now we don't even know if that game's going to come out. And that's a sad, sad, sad thing. Because I really like LucasArts. Because I feel that those people over there are making a big mistake. Because Star Wars, you know, I, I love the lightsaber. I love the little furry guys, you know. I just, I don't like that long-eared son of a bitch, you know. You guys know I'm talking about with his ja-ja rings and pinks. <laughs> Now, that song, bitch, I don't like him. His character's kind of whack, and he don't need to be anything. So in the future, if they are doing anything with games or anything else, I hope they just omit that guy and never bring him back because he's a bad character. But hopefully we'll see some third people, well, third person people, third person, third party. There, third party is the word I'm looking for, son. Third party companies will pick this up and continue to develop these games. That way... All of us people out here are stuck out here in the middle of the redneck in the Ozarks and we got ourselves a computer. We can get on the pewter there and you know, click a little few buttons and you know kill us some things and do some stuff. So I think it's a sad day indeed that LucasArts has finally become a skeleton in the closet and no longer in business. Sad. Sad news. Now, next up cousins, you guys all know they got those old Macintoshes out there, these kind of overpriced things. Many people out in the PC world don't like these things. They, I spit on them, you know what I mean, even you know, on them, you know, even y'all don't like them, like, y'all don't like them, that's what I'm saying, but for those people out there who have one and want to upgrade it, there's something else coming out. Now, y'all know last week, the people at Sapphire released their new HD 7950, that's right, this was their HD 7950 Mac edition, it was all white, it was beautiful and pretty, and you know, this thing was very cool. Now. NVIDIA and EVGA always want a piece of the pie and want to one-up those red people over there at AMD have come up with their new version of the GTX 680 featuring, you know, 1536 CUDA cores. You know, it's got its two gigabytes GDR5 memory, basically all the same things that your standard GTX 680 has, but it's all geared for that there Macintosh, which means it might work in a Hackintosh as well. That's right. So those are all the current stories that are going on and you can find all that information if you look down there at the link in the description below by the like button you guys can go down there and check all that stuff out now also what would the news be without the deal of the day that's right dang it boy we got a deal for you for those people out there who like borderlands Borderlands 2 is on special right now. Right now for the PC, you can get yourself there a copy of that there game for only $19.99, son. Why, that's less than a six-pack of your doggone malt liquor that you get there, boy. So, you know, free moonshine instead, rather. You don't get that homemade stuff like the apple pie. Mmm, delicious stuff out there. So, that's about it, folks. Now, like I said, if you guys missed anything at all, make sure you guys click on those links in the description below so you don't miss out on anything. We appreciate it. We hope you like this here redneck version of the tech. That's right, redneck tech. I'm Homer, your host, and we'll see you guys back here. Make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you do. Make sure you do. You are in my voodoo spell. You are in my voodoo spell, and you'll like this video. See you later. I'm happy of that.
Yeah. Oh.